Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying the Lay's Taste of America. We have three flavors to try for you. I have the pimento cheese. New England lobster roll and the Chesapeake Bay crab slice. These were sent to us from Jason in Maryland. He got online on Amazon and he ordered uh, the, uh, the variety box and he got all 12 of the Taste of America uh, Lay's for us. They were all in one box, they were $20. Unfortunately, as of the day that I'm filming this, I did not see it on there. I looked I mean, at all. At all, there wasn't even a place where it said sold out. So hmm. I, I, I just did not see it at all. And I, I typed in Lay's Taste of America, didn't see it at all. There are some people selling some individual bags. There's some people selling like two bags together, or three bags together. I did not see this variety box, but it has been sold out in the past and it has come back. Right. So I would check if you want to try all 12, I would keep checking Amazon. This was $20 and I don't know how much he paid for shipping, but I know it was $20 to get the 12 bags. So we're going to be trying the pimento cheese first. It is inspired by Sunday Socials and Southern Charm. Here's a taste of creamy sharp cheddar and pimento pepper. Y'all are so welcome. It's 160 calories per serving, about 15 chips, or 430 calories for the bag. And we, I love pimento cheese. I do too. I yeah. have made uh, pimento cheese two different ways on this channel. Um, I think it was in one video though. I said the title was like making pimento cheese two ways. Um, so uh, if you're interested, it's very simple to make. It's a very good um, cheesy Cheese. chip. Mm -hmm. And you get a little bit of the, the pepper feel a little bit. These are these taste just like their um, cheddar and sour cream chips to me. They're very creamy. They make a cheddar and sour cream, which is like one of my favorite chips. These taste just like it. Has a very creamy flavor in a very crispy potato chip. That being said, they're excellent chips. That's delicious. Mm. Oh, like I said, that's always my favorite anyway. And these are the ones, if you're curious, these are only available in certain parts of the United like different States. Different regions. Different regions. These are the ones that we get here. They are mm -hmm. so good. They're very good, but just know that they don't taste like pimento cheese. They, they didn't capture pimento cheese. They didn't anymore. capture pimento cheese, but they, they got the cheese part. They got the cheese. Maybe in, the creaminess the is supposed to represent the mayonnaise. The mayonnaise, but there's no that pimento flavor is missing, which mm -hmm. is what makes pimento cheese pimento cheese is right. that red pimento peppers. In right. There. So they miss it. They need a little bit of a vinegar in there or a little bit of a peppery. I don't know. They, they if you it. live overseas and you happen to be watching this, you're going to have to let us know if you can buy pimentos. Yeah. Because some places you would think that that would be available everywhere and it's not. So yeah. they're like a little red pickled pepper. Yeah. Let us know if you this, can buy can, little little jars or yeah. of those. They're not pet whole peppers. They're like sliced up chopped pepper. Right. Yeah. Um, so this is the. New England Lobster Roll, and it's inspired by Lobster Shacks of the Northeast. Uh, there's a taste of fresh lobster served on a buttery grilled roll. It's wicked good. I've never had a lobster roll before. I don't think I've ever had lobster before. Right. That's, we're kind of bad judges of this because we've never had lobster. We've never had a lobster roll. We've never had anything to do with lobster. I don't know that, I don't know. I've seen them on a plate and it looks like a giant cockroach to me. I don't know that I would want to. I think I would ha rather have it out of the shell than have to do it myself with those oh, yeah. little tentacle ugh, in its eyes. It looks like a roach. So you'd be okay if the lobster meat was already out and it was in a salad or something like yes, that? Yes, I'd be, a, well, even just out on a plate. If somebody just took it out of the shell and put it on a plate for me, it would be better for me because looks like a bug. Well, if this is what a lobster roll tastes like, I'd eat it all day. It's very good. Mm-hmm. It honestly tastes like just a, a spicy chip, or mm -hmm. a, like a spice chip. I don't get any fishiness to it. No. Or any kind of... Garlic powder, red bell pepper. No, I can taste those. 
New, Eng New England lobster roll seasoning. See, we don't have anything. I mean, they might sell that yeah. seasoning at Walmart, but that's nothing that we would ever buy. Because Old Bay is the only fish seasoning we know of. Mm -hmm. Yeah, That's very good. They're very, very good. And I don't know if they're tasty. They might have a little bit of a buttery flavor uh, to it. Yeah. All right, these are the Chesty Bay Crab Spice. Um, inspired by crab shacks along the Atlantic, um, here's a taste of the bay with custom blended spices ready to savor your, let's get cracking. So now Kevin has had these. He had these with really Andrew. Uh, they did a video where they compared the Lay's to the Hers and the Uts. Mm -hmm. And they compared those three because they all, all three of them had this Chesapeake Bay wow. Crab, crab season. season. Oh, I didn't tell you the calories on this one. Um, the lobster roll is 18 chips or 15 chips is 160 calories or 430 for the bag. Which is the same, right? or almost same. And the Chesapeake Bay one is 150 for 17 chips and 430 for the bag. They're all about the same. They're all, yeah. So basically the same. I have not tried these. So this will be a surprise to me. Well, again, they, they won't taste fishy. So it doesn't have a, it's literally the spice. It's not the, the crab itself. And Andrew loves this spice. He likes this. It, it's very, um, for me, it has a very strong, it's strong. like, dill weed kind of flavor. Or, maybe it's not dill weed, maybe it's um, um, cucumber, not cucumber, um, celery seed or some. One of those spices is really strong in there. It has um, onion powder, sunflower oil, paprika extracts. You sure it's off the paprika? Because I think it's paprika. It might be, but there's also that. I don't know that. I think it's sharp, paprika. Strong, strong flavor. My mom, when she would make dressed eggs or deviled eggs, she would always put paprika on top because it just added a little bit of color to them. I stopped adding the paprika to that, and when I make potato salad, she would put it on the top of her potato salad. I stopped adding paprika to the top of the potato salad and I don't put it on the top of the uh, dressed eggs either just because I don't like a lot of paprika. Right. Well, that's, that's I don't whatever mind it is, a little strong. bit like in the recipe, like if it's a little bit in recipes, but I don't want it like sprinkled on right. top to where I'm going to get a bite of it without anything else. Yeah. So for me, that is not one that I would buy. Yeah, it's very, all. very strong spice. It's flavor. very strong. It and stays I think that's why you. Andrew likes it. Andrew likes strong. Andrew likes to eat seaweed. I mean, somebody that always eats seaweed. Flavors. I mean, yeah. But well, my favorite is pimento cheese. New England lobster roll would be, be second. And really, I personally would avoid the Chesapeake Bay one. They'd be my third, but I would never buy them intentionally. Just because the slice is so strong. They gave us the right chips in Kentucky. They did, because it's. Although I really like the, the egg bra, really, I mean the lobster roll, really, really like the lobster roll. It's mm -hmm. just, the, you can't beat the cheese flavor. No, if you like cheese, if you like cheesy uh, potato chips at all, you're going to like these. Yeah. Um, so that would be my first, and then New England, yeah. and then I wouldn't buy the Chesapeake yeah. Bay. No offense fun. at all. It's just, it is that paprika. Yeah. It's I mean, just, think about if you, were too to, much. if you were to eat that with a cheeseburger or a hot dog or something, it would just kill the flavor. For me, it would ruin it. Yeah. Exactly. I would, I would, don't want any of that yeah. on there. Yeah, she's strong. So, I hope you all enjoyed the video. Thank you again to Jason, and thanks for watching.